Hey, hotels. <laughs> we stay coming here. It's like an hour outside of Dallas. It's four o'clock. Sis is hungry. We supposed to be here at three, but the cold can't dry. So yeah, la la la. la. Stayed up all yesterday recording and editing, and I'm sleepy. But yeah, say, man, say it's time to go gamble. Retire, poopy. Okay, go sleep. Okay, guys, look at this bathroom. I always love their bathroom. They got the little um bison soap. Well, it don't really look like that anymore. This one the Native American territory. Choctaw. Okay, we got sanitizer wipes. But I like the shower. Look at this. You turn on over here and you walk over here. This is a grown and sexy shower. <laughs> and that's all I'm gonna say about that. Period. Look at me and my little moo moo. So guys, we okay. <sighs> Y'all <sighs> we still standing, let's just say that. So, cause I don't want to hold it. So our initial plan was to drive to see Bay's dad, but he told us do not get on the road because he will be worried the whole time because it's a nine hour drive. Um, Nicole anxiety is pretty bad, rightfully so. Her mom just got diagnosed with it. Um, her mom just got diagnosed with breast cancer and her dad just got put on hospice. So here I am thinking I'm having a rough 2020 and she found that out within 12 hours of each other. Um, so her anxiety is really bad. So we just needed to get out really quick. We haven't done anything but ate and sat by the pool, but she just wanted to get out the house. So that's why we're here, which is making my anxiety bad because it's too many motherfucking people at this casino. So I'm just like, I'm gonna go to the room and edit, okay? Um, but we making it. Um, glory to God, we making it. I don't know what 2020 is trying to teach all of us, but 
There's there has to be a lesson and a blessing in this some kind of way. So yeah. That's all folks. I'm about to go watch some TV, check some emails, and I'll see y'all tomorrow when I get my keys to my warehouse. Bye. Yeah, I thought I saw a flat me on I'm about to sue that ass. Reselling my stuff. <laughs> we out. So we're at the outlet. Hey. <laughs> this the next day. I just put, y'all know, I travel in and out in the same outfit. I'm not packing all those clothes. So we're at the, UG. no we not, <laughs> Croc store. <laughs> I said we're at the UG store. <laughs> So guys this is everything i got but you're gonna have to wait till my birthday haul to see everything but these because it's my birthday stuff i got these for a dollar <laughs> one dollar they won't run up for one dollar and some cute shades this is rue 21 guys oh and uh oop. yeah all right, guys, I'm straight back from staycation. Hence, <laughs> the same outfit. Oh, I already talked about that. Because I had to come straight back to a meeting to look at a warehouse storage. So, yeah, I'm out here right now. So, Lego. Hopefully, this is my last time. I'm not one of them type of people that like to look at 500 different things. Man, I'm simple. Let me get somewhere I can put a desk to print my orders and racks to put my inventory. That's all I need at a decent price. So let's go. Who did I go home today? You you stay far, huh? You said 45 minutes? Yes, I live in Mesquite. Oh, gosh, Mesquite. You know, sometimes that traffic, you know, sometimes. Yeah. You can when did 20 years. start getting so congested? I don't know. I, I, was, enjoying, I was enjoying COVID traffic. <laughs> So guys, I will be moving into my warehouse tomorrow. I got the keys, went got a padlock, double protection, and God is good. So I'm about to go in here and shower because clearly I'm looking like yesterday. I need probably about two showers. I need to go in here and shower and um get some videos up for you guys, but God is good. I get my employee a key. I got the keys, the keys, the keys. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> big shook, big shook, big plat. You know. Key to the, you know the vibes. <laughs> Period. Employee of the month, get a key. A race. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> much i decided to go ahead all right guys so since i am laying in the bed all day and i'm not doing much i'm just editing i decided to go ahead and show you guys the small business hack of the week and i figured that i would do this in every weekly vlog instead of just doing one business video i probably will get around to doing that but i want you guys to get these business hacks now so this ship this site right here is called shippo um, go shippo.com and this is what I ship everything from okay so this is what happens you integrate your website with shippo that way all of your orders will automatically be right here in the unfulfilled I stay on it so all my orders are fulfilled I don't want to click the fulfilled tab because then to show you everybody who's ordering and I cringe when I'm watching videos and they show people addresses and who ordered for them and stuff like that i literally cringe so i'm not gonna do that so go shippo you integrate it i have it integrated with my um sanitizer website and my shapewear website to where anytime people place an order it sends the order here and i just put in how much you weigh or i don't even do that because i have the measurements in on the website so it comes over it automatically weigh and it allows you to pick the shipping option you just ship it 
um, it the label come here and um, you just print it it's that simple you can even hold all your orders and wait and then print them all at the same time so you can just have one big string of invoices or shipping labels or whatever um, they do charge like a very low fee I think it's like I think I don't even think it's five dollars a month or five cents per transaction, something like that. It is extremely low. That way you can label all your packages from home and then you can schedule a delivery for somebody to pick up your package. Or you literally can go to the post office like I do and just ask them to let you dump them. Tell them you don't want a receipt, you don't need them scanned, they already labeled, you just want to dump them. Um, yeah, Shippo. And what I really, really like about Go Shippo is they bill you once your bill gets to a hundred dollars so what will happen is weekly weekly let's say that if i have a slow week um i don't get a bill until it hit a hundred dollars and then they take it right out of my bank account but if it's booming like i think my first lunch i had like seven thousand dollars in shipping fees yeah it was that much and we'll talk about how to get your expenses down in my next video but um Every single time I hit like over a hundred, when it caught it, it was charging my bank. So it was like a three hundred dollar transaction, a thousand dollar transaction. Anytime it hit over a hundred, girly, go ahead and charge you because they don't want you to have this big bill. And um, yeah, you just skip out on them. So yeah, go shippo. You print the labels from home. Everything. Their address is already plugged in. All you do is pick the option you want to go. Pay for the label and print. So, since we're on this, let's see what Sticker Mule Deal of the Week is. The Deal of the Week is $9 for 50 custom 3x3 circle roll labels. So, let me grab a couple of these because that's really, really cheap. Because, like I said, anything that you get your logo on is kind of expensive right now. Especially since everybody know you, everybody has a small business now. I really took a swimsuit to the casino this weekend and couldn't wear it like here maybe it's not oh yeah all eyes on me swimsuit two eggs baby that booty was sagging mm, so i end up having to wear a black one from Shein. um that i haul right when the pandemic started that i took a backup yeah i love these things i ordered um my bottom row i don't want to open them because i haven't cleaned them but my bottom row i reordered because my bottom row is made in the mold of my teeth. And I reordered another set to where the bottom row is straight. So it's going to be a little harder for me to talk in them. But they're going to be straight. Oh, shoot. Well worth the investment. I'll link the video right here. Oh, my gosh. It says, happy birthday, beauty. Wishing you happiness and wellness on your special day. Enjoy this gift as you celebrate. Love, Derma E. I'm not going to open it up on camera because I'm going to save it for my birthday haul. Y'all, get y'all home girl over here. She headed to track practice. So, I told her that there's an app. Well, it's our neighborhood watch group. And so, they've added an app where you can say yes or no if you're going to have candy for Halloween. What you say? They don't need that app. These kids need to get it out the mud like we did. We didn't have no app to just look on and be like, okay, let's go to this house. No, we had to. Not Did you say get it out the mud? Yes. Girl, you need to sit down <laughs> somewhere. Finish. <laughs> we didn't have to. We didn't have no apps. We knocked out every day. If it was candy, it was candy. If it wasn't candy, we moved on to the next house. Okay, so when it's time for you to start your, your another business, I'm going to tell you to get it out the mud. You don't need platinum D hell, big shoe. What they got to do with Halloween? <laughs> <laughs> She goofy, y'all. I'm so sleepy. I got zero rest this weekend. Let's keep pushing, though. And get it out the mud. Period. <laughs> hey, guys. So, here's an update. <coughs> I decided to cancel Vegas for my birthday. And um, reroute the trip, my birthday trip, to Nashville. So, Nicole can go home and see both of her parents. And we can find something to do in Nashville. I'm not pressed about it at all. I actually really wasn't too, too happy, overly excited about going to Vegas. Especially after I saw how busy the casino was this past weekend. And so, um... Gosh, hold on. I'm going to run me off the road. So, um... Look, I'm 40.
party. I don't celebrate a lot of birthdays. I ain't priest. So, and I'm still going to celebrate just in a different city than I thought. So, yeah, I'll get you a platinum D. I'm just saying. It's my birthday, but I'm more concerned about her. So, we're going to her home. Ready to move. Look at this. This thing broke. All my designer sunglasses fell. Are you kidding me? Oh, ready to fight. That's all I need is a fork. Okay, and I eat spinach straight up out the can like that too. I ain't playing. Love it. I love this little old man chair. Actually, it's my auntie chair. My cousin moved her. And I took this chair. I love it. My cousin keeps saying, I'm going to come get that chair out your hands. I know it's in the way. Mm -mm. I mean, she should let this chair. It's our thinking chair. Mm. Yeah. Mm. All right, bye. We got a little shook. She got the crab legs, the wings, Hold up. the fish. The fish. The crab legs. Oh. Period. And goodbye. Well, you need to pick them feet up. Oh, that's my package. They always get our names mixed up. Take it in the house. Goofy. I like to make you jump out of this car, then. <laughs> they get them Jesus samples. <laughs> I'm finna jump on your head. <laughs> All he do is get up and check them in. Like he got a big, big check coming. Big check daddy. I'm not to show y'all my house. I just be sitting in the car getting my vitamin D. I need to be taking stuff to this warehouse, but of course I gotta wait on the cold. She would kill me if I lift some stuff right now. Cause that should be irritating my chest and my girdle. Let go. But sticker mule. <laughs> sticker mule gonna ban me. Don't do it. Please don't. I need y'all. I'm trying to make it. Another roll. I think this is the last roll of tape I was waiting on. And this is not tape tape. This is the kind you have to actually wet. I mean duct tape. You have to wet and then wrap it around your box. So if you order these, make sure you don't accidentally throw these little blue things away. Because that's what you use. It's like a sponge when you wet it. They put so much cute stuff in their packages. So let me show you guys real quick. They don't sponsor me. I just like Sticker Mule. So they put... These kind of stickers like the laser cut, which I got some of these. Hold on, let me show y'all. This is a very unflattering view, y'all. Look at my treadmill. Baby, take that down and get on it. It's pushed up against the wall. I need to come down so I can be like, okay. Anyway, so here are here's one logo. This is the one of the logos that I didn't decide to go with, but I like it. So that's one of the stickers. And then here's another one. And they come in you guys' packages. A lot of people were asking me, can they buy these? But they come in your package. Both of them came from Sticker Mule. So this is theirs. They put it in every package. This is how to use this tape, duct tape. Here's another one of theirs that's laser cut like that. And here's their coaster, which I have some of these too from them. And then... um. Let me show you all of the tapes. So this is the one I just showed you. I have like six different emails, different businesses, personal. So I got one, two, three, four, five. When it was their special, six. This is in the other design. Because like I said, you're not going to catch this stuff this cheap no any other time. So every week they got a deal. This week their deal is um, round stickers. So I did order some of those because I do use them. Um, so yeah, let's hop into something else. I just be all over the place, y'all. This is from Juno & Co. I do have a code. I will leave it below. Um, Juno & Co. Will you be my Juno babe? Maybe, maybe not. Introducing our new bombshell palettes full of soft pinks and nudes made to mesmerize and hypnotize. Use code Platinum D, baby. Okay, so what we got up in here? Two palettes. 
I'm move it up fast because there my vlogs be long. Y'all watching though. Love y'all. So here's the packaging on both. Oops, maybe that's backwards. So, ooh, this is a cute palette. This one right here is Bum Shell. It's the Starlight Eyeshadow Palette in Bum. Ooh, I'm going to fuck it up. In Bum Shell. Oh, ooh, that's pretty, y'all. And so, let's see what color is the second one. You see me swinging. Oh, you see me swinging. And y'all don't have to be afraid to send me stuff anymore. <laughs> I have to start showing them in videos like this. But I really like um, showing all that stuff and wearing big haul. So this is the Siren palette. This is PR though. Let's be clear. Ooh, look at the Siren palette. So that's Juno & Co. Very affordable company. I will link them below. Let me pack up some orders. Y'all want to pack these orders with me while baby girl at work? Lego. I meant baby girl at track practice. I kind of don't want to do her work, but I got to have them ready to take to the post office when I pick her up. So it's only a few orders. I have some products. I'm going to explain this in another video um, that are not my products. Let's be very clear on that. They're just deals and steals that I came across and was able to bring to you guys super cheap. I call it the Peekaboo Collection. People are buying that stuff right now, and everything on there is $6 right now because I'm trying to get rid of it. So, um, that's what people are buying right now because clearly I don't have no inventory. Well, I do now. <laughs> but I haven't put anything on the site yet because I want to drop all my new pieces and restock at the same time. I know y'all waiting, but it's coming. All right, guys. See, this is why I have a love-hate relationship with press on. I don't know how many places I've been. And this nail being gone. I just realized it. So I'm so So I'm so glad she sent extra. So I'm real ashy. Oh, 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 oh. So I fill these buckets to the brim. And then with the rest, I just put it in storage bins that look like this. like this and then as these get empty i refill them so i'm about to dock should pay today because i sent her five orders before track practice none of them are packed so guys they really just ran me hot because my daughter is homeschooling right now she done set her ass up in here all morning playing in that phone and now i gotta pack all these orders so they'll be ready to ship out when i pick her up from track practice and this is not the first conversation we've had about this because I told her to fix me some breakfast this morning and she never replied and I had to get up. But the phone was right in her hand. So I just turned her whole internet off. She finna be hot as hell at me when she get out of track practice. I don't give a fuck though. So I'm printing these slips. It's one, it's only three that she didn't do. Like she get paid good money, probably more than some adults. To sit at home and pack orders and then don't have them ready so this is a packing slip so i know what to print out and i packed i do this from shippo i can't show y'all because I, I explained earlier i don't like showing y'all people information so now what i'm going to go through and do is match it's by the um label form so i always ship in an 8 by 10 or a 10 by 16 so i just fill that in so I've weighed them all and the shipping for all of these packages came out to 1023. So I just click the button to buy them. Then I click the button to download them and they will all shoot out. I have the printer right here, y'all. They will all shoot out. Change it to four by six together. So when I have, uh oh, I turned it off accidentally. When I have bulk orders, this thing go all night. Okay, so first thing first, um, I take out three of these cards because it's three of them. So the front has this information and the back is how you can be featured and get a percentage off your order. So that's for each order. Then I take out, let me take out some of my free gifts. Some people get coasters, some people get stickers. So I only have two coasters left. 
So this last person will get a laser sticker. Just some little additives. I'm quite sure all that go in the trash, but some people might use it. And then um, take out three of these. This is what I put on the outside envelope so they'll know what it is. And then let's place the packing slip with the, each person get their packing slip, of course, and put their shipping label with their packing slip. Boom. Miss Smith, your first initial is a C. Thank you so much. And the reason why I'm saying that is because your name come up every week. I'm not lying. I'm going to put some extra in your order just for that. Watch this. So, let's start with... No, let's get the mailing stuff. So, guys, from here on out, I send the stuff that's not mine in these envelopes. I started in these envelopes, but then they were kind of thin and tearing. So, I put the stuff, the peekaboo line in this envelope and save my good envelopes for the good thick stuff like the vest and stuff. So I'm going to take three of these out and then I'm going to um, take my confetti out and it also has my thank you stickers in here if you guys can see that. So what I do on the outside of these is take this Contour Me by Nikki sticker and just put it on the outside. And I'm trying to move fast because I don't to hold it. I'm mad about it. Shoot, that girl, huh. she get paid more than some adults and want to skip off the track practice and I do her work. You get fired. Don't think you're irre irreplaceable, boo-boo, because you're my daughter. All right. Then, y'all, she come in the Croc store the other day, get in there picking out all these Crocs and get to the register looking at me. I said, little mama, where your credit card? She looking goofy. Then you gonna say she left it at home. I said, okay, well, cash out me the money. And I put it on mine. Then she gonna put the shoes back. Then you got a whole job. Okay, so that's how I look on there. It looks better on my white envelopes, but that's that. So now it's time to pull the orders. So let's just, let's see. This first person got one of the red lick and a smile. What? Somebody got a relic. Hold up. Boom. So I put the actual item in here. So they'll know what they ordered and can't say, you didn't send me what I ordered. The packing slip, free gift, promotional card. Then I go in and put some I know y'all hate this stuff because I do, but I don't know. Hey. I hate cleaning it up. Like when companies put it in my box. And then I just put the mailing label on the outside. I put that machine. Oh, I already did a small business hack on um, how you can get sticker back mailing labels and don't have to pay for a $200 laser machine. And then I'll take a thank you sticker and slap it right here. And she ready to go. I don't want the address for sure. Slide her to the side. So who's next? She got a lot of stuff, y'all. Baby girl shopping. She got one relic and a small. Let me just go and pull it. So now they are sold out. She got, ooh, hello, y'all. She got a lot of stuff. This is all I have left of the peekaboo line. So once it sell out, it won't come back unless my vendor has specials on it again. The peekaboo line, once it sell out, it don't come back. Thank you, Miss McCall. Put your little bit of stuff. <laughs> I be worried about some smiles and stuff, y'all. They don't be selling. Look at all this she got. <laughs> Miss Smith got the wonder what wonder where highway stung in large. Must be the last one. We're the largest. It is the last one. It's a cooling spray. So I'm gonna send her that for free. 
items that I have on a peekaboo collection right now. So if you're watching this vlog, you better swipe them up. They six dollars. These are the shorts one piece. These are the thongs. I have smalls. Let's see, smalls, mediums. I think I just sold the last large. One extra large in here, surprisingly. The big sizes go fast. And here's the black shorts. I love these. I'll put a picture of me up in them. Oh, no, I deleted it because they said you better not put that on the website. Medium, mediums, mediums, saw mediums. You hear what I say? You better be in there and fruit, not them cookies. And then what you finna come out this kitchen with, Daddy? A bowl of what? Strawberries. Strawberries. That's what I thought. So we got the scale. Let's see how close I was on my win. I said that this was, I hope it's close because I realized I waste a lot of money because I be guessing. And then if it's less, that's money I could have saved. And yeah, it's like 30, 40 cents. But if you times 30, 40 cents times 500 to 1,000 packages, come on, Nikki. So I said this one will weigh 11 ounces and it weighs, uh-oh, it might not have enough on this one. Let me go reprint this one. I'm all the way off. I'm, this is a pound and an ounce. Don't be a goofball like me. Weigh this stuff before you print the label. My little employee that's almost fired coming out of Aldi. Girl, we can afford a sack. We got you could have took that sack. Why you take it in there? What you get? Lettuce and what? I got lettuce. Why you didn't get taco lettuce? Because they didn't have that. They had like this lettuce. And you know we got bag. rice. It's one bag. Oh. It's it right what you get guacamole mm -hmm. so lettuce guacamole and rice yeah you got corn mm -hmm. you got that at home okay homemade chipotle ginger ale and this company j majesty hair collection told me that this purse was so heavy for my small black business haul because of stuff in it so we're gonna open it after i eat it's i don't know why the flash is on but here we go <laughs> y'all i want to scream because i went on her site and bought some stuff and i have a feeling this is what i bought oh no it's not okay okay okay, okay. i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited yeah guys i love you guys so much guys it's lat. it's a lash applicator with some spoolies oh my gosh look at these lashes i cannot believe i didn't know it was something in that bag because it was heavy. And look at these sunglasses. No, look at how she has her own customization on her bags. Oh my gosh. Oh, you're kidding me. This is gorgeous. This gotta go. My queen to the rescue. Let me see my queen. My princess. <laughs> All these things have failed. I don't know. It's just time to move. Right. Right. But the, get the rest of my shades out of there, babe. But thank God my shades are not going to break. <laughs> Sachi. Sachi. <laughs> Those are my favorite shades, y'all. Yeah, get my watch out of there, too. Well, this is going to have to do for now. And this is irritating my soul that this is cracked. So, yeah. Guys, I could scream right now. I just missed my exit. I'm trying to prop the phone up on my blogging stand. But I just took baby girl to track practice and Nicole went by the warehouse the other night and she didn't feel like um it was suitable for me. So I called the lady who owned it and was like, do you have anything else I can work with? And she told me, yeah, move me right away. So I'm going to look at the new space right now. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. And then I'm going to get some bins and some tables, a rug. It's a warehouse, baby. So we had this discussion on Snapchat. There ain't no point of doing all that damn decorating. It's a warehouse. It's just somewhere for me to store my stuff. Storage. Store my stuff and um, package it so I can get it out of my house. So I'm not there. I might have like a little office corner. Other than that, I'm not spending no money. I had expenses out the ass last month and I made a good grip. But the grip of them expenses like blew my wig back. 
Yeah, tell me why my my boy girl, my mom wig was up pulled back, y'all. It was pulled back. I was like, uh uh, baby, pull that up. Yeah, this girl in this car looking at me crazy because it's like I'm talking to myself. But anyway, so yeah, I'm, I ain't doing that. Like for real, my expenses, my expenses last month was probably somebody's salary. Dead ass. So now, uh uh, baby, period and goodbye. I ain't spending nothing. All right, guys, I'm in Aldi now looking for, they be having like good office stuff in here sometimes. I didn't see a difference in the office space, so there was no point in changing it. So let's see what Aldi got. Guys, that's an ice maker like the one I got at Aldi for 89 bucks. That's a whole 50, 60 dollar difference. Well, a hundred and something, cause when I bought mine, it was 200. They're 159 now on Amazon, but 89 here at Aldi. No look, I'm seriously gonna go home and just order everything off Amazon. But I'm headed into the Dollar Tree now. So guys, she said these aren't selling and they trying to get rid of them. So she'll give me them for $3 each. So I just got all of them cause I never know how much I'm gonna need. Dylan, Dylan. Now I'm looking for dividers. I don't see any, so I think I'm gonna do this for an inventory lock. When in Ace is right by me. And I found one of these. It was 29 and these tables were on sale for $29 this week. Originally 59. I should have got both two of them, but baby, baby, y'all know my chest be hurting. I can't pick them things up. It's lazy. I'm not taking this stuff out of my truck. <laughs> so I've literally sat out here and labeled it outside. Oh, look. I don't try to see too much. This is for overflow stuff. Guys, so I got some wedding dresses. <laughs> baby, baby. Oh, all white dresses. It's after Labor Day, but who still go by that? And they are from a company called Ever Pretty. And I got them all in the 18. Oh my gosh, but this is, I don't know if this is Chinese sizes or our sizes. Um, but we'll see. And I, I don't even think I will be able to tell you guys because I don't know what size I am anymore. So I don't know if I can tell you if they're true to size, but we'll see. So I'm gonna take them all out, hold on. So there are actually four of them. So I'm actually gonna just take All right guys, so this is the best way I can show you guys these and easiest for me. So you have this little sheer part at the top. This is a US 18, but I'm having a feeling these run kind of small because I was a US 18 before I lost weight. So go up two sizes. Here's the side. Uh oh yeah. Here's the side right here. And let me see, let me see, can I show you guys the back? Zedat. Uh, hold up, I'm gonna do it like this. This is new to me. And turn. Hope I didn't mess that up. All right, guys, here's another one. It's an 18 also. This is cute. It will not zip though. Has a little sheer part right here. It is sleeveless. Um, yeah, has a little flow at the bottom. Um, it will not zip at the back though. So I don't want to turn around. I have my mirror tilted at an angle. This one up close. I don't have on any shapewear. I just have on a bra. I don't even have on panties to be honest. Okay, going to the chapel and we're gonna get married. <laughs> yeah, so clearly these aren't my style guys. But they are beautiful dresses. Um, you know, I would be a little bit more elaborate, exact jewels popping everywhere, a train to the back of the church type vibe. But I feel like these are quick, cheap, simple dresses for simple brides or last minute brides who don't want to spend a lot of money. This, I'm not sure this is supposed to be out the shoulder, 
but it looks way better to me like that but you can put it on the shoulder and this i will replace it just like the last one i was trying to tell you guys but i got a phone call and you guys know i vlog on my phone i will replace it with one of those bling belts i actually think i have one i'm gonna dig real quick so here's the side and here's the back. Oops. <sighs> Period, poo. It's layered. I think this is my favorite one. It's kind of forgiving. You don't have to worry about wearing a shaper or nothing. It automatically like flares. Let me know which one was you guys' favorite. Well, like I'm done. But let me know which one is you guys' favorites when I after I try on this last one. All right, guys these clips are going to be a little off because i'm recording them long ways instead of sideways so this is another one i would wear off the shoulder um i don't have this one buttoned all the way that's the side right there <laughs> hold up no, i'm just playing and then the back is not buttoned but it's real cute it won't zip on me so these are definitely not true to size so they say they are US 18s, but I guess they are US 16s. So go up two sizes if you like, but the quality is good. You know, that's the last one. I will leave the link to these dresses below. Maybe you will have a formal all white event you need to attend or you're a simple bride. So I highly recommend them just go up two sizes. Guys, so I'll click this gloss. Oh! I ordered some more. It was in my small black business haul in my last vlog. And I love it. What I like is you can get this for like 12 or you can get two for 20 to save money. Or you can get it in like a smaller container for like $2 or squeeze two for a dollar, y'all. And it is Libra Glitz. <laughs> it was meant for me. This is Jay Marie Cosmetics. She sent me that big box of my small black business haul in my last vlog. Y'all, mm. mm, look at this. Oh, and just like that, I'm back in my moo and my bunny. So I will link the gloss and the dresses below. Um, I came back on here to tell. Oh, I'd be wishing I could just come back, need some water, and um, boom, be on the camera, and be fine as hell. But I can't, y'all. I'm I'm the most realist youtuber blogger y'all i ever see i i can't like youtube is not my full-time job i have kids i have responsibilities a dad to take care of a spouse a house businesses so i don't feel the need to get dressed up every day um and i'm just around the house handling business and no shade to any uh, any other youtubers or anything but like i got responsibilities you know they can get up get cute hey i'm doing this today I can't. I mean, I can, but to lay around the house, it's a little cute for y'all. Y'all, y'all know I can slay if I want to. Thumbs up if y'all know I can sway when I want to. So these vlogs, you're getting the real deal, okay? And a lot of you guys have been asking about my bunnets, and I tell you, um, I don't kind of promote the company anymore. If you've been following me a long time, you know who I got the bunnets from. But um, there's been customer service issues. Um, me and a couple of other bloggers have came to the conclusion that they don't answer emails and they don't answer through file through on promises. And I was so impressed because they sent me a Christmas gift one year and then they were supposed to cancel, uh, sponsor one of my classes and I got my class all hype and everything and they never came through for me. So it made me look like a liar. So I didn't like that. I just said, I'm the realest vlogger. If me and that company can work something back out, that's fine. But that's why I don't shout them out anymore. <laughs> Tell me all about these. These are not. <laughs> They'll be in my next black on business haul. It's a whole package. Bob, the builder looking at. <laughs> one easy way is to bring them outside and just spray them. I did that one. Little should doing this one. I told Nicole that Niles was uh, messed up. She come out here and spray them boys every day and didn't notice that. You see why I got all this stuff on my glasses now? <laughs> God damn, I don't want no shower. Well, that didn't quite work, so I'm real ghetto. I'm gonna just take some wig shine 
and go back in where it still look real dusty to me. And boo. <laughs> I don't care, I don't care. Talk about me in the comments. But this dang thing was $200. So I ain't throwing it away. Oh, let me get this up. That's from my chair being over here. We're testing views for try on haul since we both do them now. So it's either going to be this view with the blinds closed or this view. That's why she's painting the wall white primer and then she's going to go over it with like that cream color. I'm packing up some things I left out, like a couple of beans, extension cord, stapler pins, a light um, milling. You can get these free at the post office. So I'm just going to go like this is a large flat rate box i think or it's a medium it's a medium flat rate box but if you can find these boxes right here or if you can find these boxes though right here they don't have flat rate at all or you can order them online the boxes are free just make sure if you use these boxes you are shipping priority only not first class not um ground or it will get sent back and here's like a smaller version of that like they have boxes for free. You just have to make sure you're shipping priority. And then here's some small flat rate boxes. See, this say flat rate. So you would have to pick the flat rate option with this. And I got another style of it right here. No, 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 sorry. This is a priority box that's not flat rate. So you got the small one that's not flat rate, but you must ship priority. The flat rate, a small one that's not. A big one that's not in a big flat rate and then you have the flat rate envelopes that look like this so basically what they mean is no matter how heavy your package is if you fit in this envelope this box this box you can mail it no matter the weight so if you want to use an envelope but don't want to go flat rate and you want free envelopes from the post office once again as long as you're going priority they have these envelopes right here and i love these for poshmark so you can get free mailing supplies um as long as you're not into the aesthetic of things good just send stuff in this but but sorry nail gone from moving last night um what i will also tell you about this is um don't get these flat rate envelopes and boxes thinking that you're saving money on shipping because sometimes you can go first class and it is way cheaper to just get your little dollar envelope and go first class because let me give you guys a prime example um um okay so say for instance i want to send somebody some sunglasses and so I say, okay, I'm just going to put it in this flat rate box. Well, this flat rate box is automatically like six bucks, I want to say now. The price has changed so much with the post. Uh, they steady going up. Okay. Or I can get a plain white box from Dollar Tree for a dollar and pay $2.50 to ship your first class. That's $3.50 right there. That saved you half. Saved you half. Yeah, this box was provided, and yeah, you can put any amount of weight in it, but it's automatically six dollars and something when you could spend three, four dollars shipping it first class. So, I always think about that. This little flimsy Walmart rack to the warehouse where I'm putting on all the pieces to display, and I'm gonna get a banner. Like, if I ever want to do a video up there, I can just record it like that. But yeah, I'm so happy. I love that one beige piece is irking my soul. Ugh. Got more robes in today. I'm excited. One more stop, y'all. Whatever the warehouse don't have, it ain't gonna have. Yeah!